Hey, what's up? It's Chris from Brooker Films, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to create knockout text right inside of Adobe Photoshop. So once you've got Photoshop open and you have an image imported, we're ready to begin. And to begin with, we're just going to start by going over to the rectangle tool and then selecting the rectangle tool. We're just going to go up and draw a shape. So we're just going to draw a rectangle in the middle of our image and then we'll go up to the top bar and we'll change the stroke color and the fill color to the same color. So as you can see in my example, you can see I'm making the stroke and the fill the same shade of blue. Now from here, I'm just going to center up that rectangle in the very center of the canvas. And then we'll go ahead and create a brand new text layer. So press the new text icon, select on the image, and we'll just type out whatever we want to write. So I'm going to put text and I just want to really make this big and bold. So I'm going to increase the size of this to 250 pixels and center this up. And it's super important that you position this exactly in the correct position inside of the box. Once you've positioned this text and you're happy with it, there's no going back. If you want to go back, you have to go back to the very beginning. So it's super important to position this text exactly where you want it. So once you're happy with that, we're going to go over to the right of Photoshop and we're going to select the thumbnail for the text layer. We're going to hold option and select the thumbnail and this will load up the mask around the text layer. So as you can see, we've got these checkered lines kind of rotating around the text layers and this is our mask. So from here, we want to select our rectangle layer, making sure that the mask is still selected. And as you can see, if we turn off the text layer, the mask is still there, but the mask is now sitting over the rectangle layer rather than the text layer. So from here, we basically want to erase the inside of that text layer. So we go over to the erase tool, we'll increase the size and the hardness, and we'll just go ahead and we'll draw over the mask and as you can see, that mask has been erased, so that text has been removed from our blue rectangle. And that is how you do the pop out effect right inside of Adobe Photoshop. Now from here, if you want to reposition this or move this, all you have to do is press Command T on your keyboard or Control T if you're on Windows. And then you can increase the scale, decrease the scale, move this around, position this, rotate this, move this to wherever you want within the frame. But this is how you do the knockout text effect right inside of Adobe Photoshop. And there you go, that's it from me for today. So if you enjoyed watching this video, then please do let me know in that comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe, check out the previous video, and I will see you tomorrow for another brand new video. Thank you for watching.